Finally, it's time to head home. Wendy Wendy. Huh? I know that car. Uh-oh. Maybe I, just, I could escape out the back. Knock, knock. Ding dong. Miss Les, my love, why do you grace me with your presence? Knock, knock. I just let myself in. I seem to have forgotten my head again, do you see? And I simply could not pass up on the opportunity to behold your glorious face once more. Hey, where are you? Darling, where are you? She must be playing hard to get. Oh, there you are, Miss Les. Ah, your screams of joy are like a siren's call. Miss Liss, I was wondering, no, if you perhaps no, would go out with me, no, in order to dinner, in order to, how many times do I have to say, discuss the future of Celery Preschool? Oh. Hm, I would think you were pretty clear before. But darling, please forgive me, I can change. Uh, yeah, yeah. Fine. Really? Well, if it's for celery, one night probably won't kill me. Maybe. Oh, I can't wait to tell Mother my first date! I know just the place. A quaint little restaurant by the beach. I'm so excited! Prince, why me? So, how long have you had a tank of water in the back of your car? Ever since I gazed into your enchanting eyes. Mr. Chutz, we just met this morning. Ah, uh, but it feels as though we've known each other for a lifetime. Twitch. Dun, dun, dun. Here we are, my love. You've got to be kidding. A seafood restaurant? You can't really be this stupid. Goldies. The chef that smiles back. Okay, I saw a pizzeria down the road. Nonsense, I insist. And don't worry your pretty little tales about the cost. I know it's a little fancy, but it's my treat. No, please, I'm a vegetarian. No excuses now. Goldie's drag. No! Remind me again why we're here. So... Remind me again why we're here to hang out. So why do I have to wear a bow? You're wanted in four dimensions, Master. You have to be incognito. So why do you have on a false mustache? Well, I'm wanted in seven dimensions. Really? Why? I killed a man with this feather. What? Really? No! I can't believe that you believed me! I'm just in disguise, so no one will recognize you with me. Zip. Fool! How dare you try to prank me! Don't forget that I'm still angered by today's mishap at the preschool. You were so close to attaining control of the dragon brat. That sort of failure will not be tolerated. Hey, I'm not the one who lost control of her. How dare you! Doll, you can do so much better. So can I take your order? What's a seraph doing working in a dump like this? Or am I? Vanish. Whoa! What just... I have no idea. Ah, that was delicious. Wouldn't you agree? Uh, no. Could I get some fresh air? Minion, look! You should keep an eye on this. He might be of some use to us. Sure, I'll come with you. Have I ever told you how your eyes glisten like the moon on this fine deep ocean surface? He's doing it all wrong. What kind of moron is he? Minion, you know what to do. I'll handle the situation here. It's a giant wave. Is it just me, or is that wave getting closer? I hope so. Whoosh. Liz, where did he go? Oh, uh, well, I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, come on, hurry up! Thud, sorry, relief. <laughs> Many hours later. Now this will be interesting. Good morning, Liz! I brought you breakfast. 
No. Please. Remain this? Dot dot dot. I didn't even read none of that properly. Please. Remain this. Thank you. Wait. Wait. Wait a second. I, I just. to tell Carter what happened last night. Crazy panic. Ah, what's wrong with this? She's a cannibal. Cool. S so what's up? I lost a tooth last night. But you don't have any tooth. Did you put it under your pillow? Yeah, and the tooth fairy came. Still panicking. I was lying down in my underwater ninja cave when I heard someone move nearby. I came up with a plan. I would discover her identity with my cunning ninja detective skills. She's here. I pretended to fall asleep once more and waited until the tooth fairy was just about to take my tooth and give me the money. Who are you? Uh, I'm the tooth fairy? Okay. Content for now with her answer, as I'd learnt what she looked like, I fell quickly back asleep for real this time. I'm here! Hello! That's her! That's the tooth fairy! Ah! Woof. The tooth fairy? Don't be silly. She doesn't really exist. She doesn't exist. Everyone knows your mom just pretends to be the Tooth Fairy. I caught my mom pretending just the other night. I could never face Flounder again. I laid her as distracted. Why is Liz crying? I don't know. Maybe she doesn't like being a cannibal. This place is scary. Maybe I should be homeschooled. Mommy said I'd fit right in. Wait, how can that girl spin so fast? And why is everything burnt and broken? This place is creepy. Hmm. They'll never notice I'm a new student in this disguise. Snake, 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 slam! But what can we do to help? I know. We'll have to make sure no intruders get in today. Hmm. This seemed really unhappy about yesterday about the intruder. Maybe they never have to find out. <laughs> no one will notice. No one noticed me. He. <laughs> no one noticed me. Now I just have to hide under this blanket until tackle Glomp! Ah! No way! A new student. Ah. <laughs> Were you trying to hide? Uh. What's your name? I'm Annabelle. Um. Well. Huh? You seem shy. Don't worry. The people here are really nice, especially Sarah. Escape! Escape! Oh, I know. I'll introduce you. I'll introduce. Oh, I know. I'll introduce you to the others. Eh? Oh, wait. Everyone will love you. <laughs> hey guys, check out my new friend. He's right over here. He's right over there. He's right over there. Freddy fled the battle. Where? <laughs> I don't see him, Annabelle. Is he an intruder? Where did he go? Very funny, Annabelle. No, really, he was there. Sure, what was his name? Uh, he didn't say. A likely story. Good detective work, Sherlock. Hey, what's going on? My friend disappeared and Carter's like, don't believe me. I believe you. Really? Sure, my friends disappear all the time. Candyland! Whoa! Mmm, it's sugar! So chilly. Okay, ready. Time to explore. Hey, what's that light? What if it's a ghost? Well, I could just go back, but that would be cowardly. And if I go back, I'd have to face that creepy fairy girl. Creepy fairy? Ghost. I'd rather take my chances with the ghost! Flee. How brave! And it's not the fair. Anything but the fair. Er, Jack Pow. Oh. Ghost. Talking potato. Huh? Wait. I'm. I'm not a potato. Hold up. I'm not a ghost. So what's your name and how'd you get here? I'm a runner. I got trapped in this place yesterday. Really? How? Well, it's a strange story. 
It was my first day of preschool, and I came a little late. Celery preschool? Just walked in. Crayon. Little did I know, this day was about to take a frightening turn for the worse. Flashlight. But suddenly I was attacked by a demon disguised as a fairy. Demon fairy? Alana. So then I went and hid in a big closet and got lost here. I can't, I can't find my way home. Hey, wait. Th that sounds like Alana wardrobe. Oh. That's how I got here, too. Well, if you're stuck here, I can lead you back to the portal. Shake, shake. Really? Uh, sure, Street Paul. Oh, thank you! I gotta get out of here! Do you know what it's like to only have sweets to eat? My tummy hurts. Okay, here's the portal. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you! Watch out, world. Alana's back. Whoa. This can't be the preschool. Whoa! Broken wall. <laughs> Where is everybody? This place is totally destroyed. Um, so is school cancelled? Well, that depends. So basically the fate of the world depends on me and Alana? Yep, pretty much. We're all doomed. Oh, don't worry, I'll be with you every step of the way. Really? Or will I? Whoa! And vanish again. Wait, no, where'd she go? What, what, what do we do? Fred? Fred? Well, Fred, what do you think you're doing? I'm going back to Candyland, duh. That's what the Seraph said to do. No, we can't. Why not? You heard what the Seraph said. You should listen to Freddy, Alana. And that's all of the 58 storyline comics so far. Hopefully there'll be some more soon. Goodbye, YouTube land people.